Hello guys, and today I am going to be showing you how to get the rubber band ball in chapter 1 of Bully Scholarship Edition. Now before we start this video, I want to make sure that you all like and subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it as it helps me pay for my rent as a jobless Brazilian. I was just crouching like a World War I soldier in the middle of trench warfare before I grappled the prefect. Why? Well, it doesn't matter what pet you do this on, but you must be crouching like a pedophile trying to get on the level of a child and shove a pet into the trash can in order to start the next glitch we're about to do. After shoving a pet into a trash can while crouching, you will notice that if you climb the stairs, you will start flying! This is good, because we need this flight in order to escape the school and find a gnome in Old Volworth Vale. Now guys, it would really help me out if you smashed the like button, subscribed to the channel, and turned on all channel notifications, as it would really help me fuel my meth addiction. Now you have to find a gnome to destroy. I chose this gnome, because it looks like the same gnome that killed my wife in the forest and impregnated my dog. So, obviously I need to get revenge like any sane human would do. In Bully, you cannot typically have more than one gnome destroyed in Chapter 1. So now, we will trick the game into thinking we are in Chapter 3 with another gnome. Now don't be fooled, this gnome isn't actually alone. Look away as actually as I do, and the federal agents hacking into the game trying to stop us are exposed. Now, simply follow what I do. The federal agents will try to stop you, so use your social engineering skills to get them away from you. Guys, smash the like button, as you should trust that I will never try to social engineer you into doing anything you wouldn't like to do. Now simply, just run around the gnome a few times. The FBI will try to get in your way, but don't worry, just run around a little bit to distract them, and they won't be able to see what happened to them. Now as you run around the gnome, you may notice that your screen may start to flicker. If you did the glitch correctly, you will now be back inside the school, and will have snow everywhere. Gnomes in this game have a special property, where they are all connected, and the gnome in Old Wharf Vale teleported you to the gnome back in the school. Now the game thinks we are in Chapter 3. Go back to the boys' dorms, and the game will actually revert back to a beta version of the game when you finish loading in the boy and storm. Now that you are back in Bully's beta, really quickly, get on the bike and start no clipping into the floor. Now, you will soon realize that you are now in Gmod. This is an even more bare bones version of Bully. You will also realize now that you're in the fucking back room. Now type in the console SVTeach1 and Third Person 1. If your player model is still Jimmy Hopkins, that means you're doing the glitch correctly. For the final glitch, we need to make a bomb that will rival the 26,172 bombs President Barack Obama dropped in 2016. Leviticus 1911. Do not steal. Do not lie. Do not deceive one another. Psalms 119, 163. I hate and detest falsehood, but I love your law. Proverbs 14, 5. An honest witness does not deceive, but a false witness pours out lies. Zephaniah 3, 13. They will do no wrong. They will tell no lies. A deceitful tongue will not be found in their mouths. They will eat and lie down, and no one will make them afraid. Guys, I don't think the glitch worked. What the fuck?
Oh, my God. 